Stun Store Email Flow Tutorial. Hello and welcome to our channel. On this video, I'm going to show you how you can make an email flow in Stun Store. So please watch till the end to properly understand the tutorial. And to create an account in Stun Store, you could also use my affiliate link below the description or earn a small commission at no additional cost to you. And by using the link, you may also get some discount or rewards upon sign up. But before that, if you don't know what is Stun Store, it is an innovative e commerce platform tailored for content creators enabling them to monetize their digital products, online courses, memberships, and email lists, in which it is designed with minimalistic interface. It allows creators to seamlessly integrate their store into social media profiles such as Instagram and TikTok, making it easy for followers to purchase products or book services directly from their profiles. And setting up a stand store is straightforward, typically taking around 17 minutes to create the first product. And users can add unlimited products, although limiting choices to six may enhance sales by reducing decision fatigue among potential buyers. And now to create an account, you can click the link in the description or click the sign up button on the top right corner. Then you will be able to be directed on this page. And to sign up, all you need to do is to fill out all of the required information, including your username, your name, email, your TikTok username, but that is just only optional, your phone number, and also to create your own password. And you also need to link your credit or debit card in here to start your 14 day free trial and after that you will be directed in here in which all you need to do is to simply pick your niche and answer the question did someone refer you or skip this part and now as you can see we have now currently under the home page of stand store and on the left side panel it will show you a variety of options that we can start navigating such as home my store income analytics customers more as instantly and many more now under this home page from here it will show you all of the data including some of the statistics such as store visits, total revenue, and also the total leads in here. And from here to start creating your product, just click this create your product button. And upon clicking on it, we will be able to be directed on this page. And all you need to do is simply choose the product type. You have here e-course, URL, webinar, recurring membership, and many more. But for instance, in those products, I'm going to choose this digital product. By simply clicking on it, we'll be directed in this page. And from here, all we need to do is to firstly pick our style, web your button, call out an even preview style. And after that, below here, you could also select an image for your thumbnail and for the step tree, which is to add text, including the title, the subtitle, and even the button in here. And it will show you on the right side panel how it looks like. However, to save this, I'm just going to save this as drop by clicking the save as drop button right here. Now going back on this page, from here it will show you that the product or digital product has now been created. However, since we're here to create an email flow, just proceed on the left side panel and click the email flows. And from here to get started, you must have an upgrade account in order to do so. And from here, just proceed by clicking this get started button below here. Then just enter here your addresses, including your street address, city, province, postal code, and country. Then just click the continue button below to proceed. Then you will be directed on this page in which it will show you in here the sample email flow, in which as you can see here the first flow after the purchase, the customer will receive this kind of email which is sample welcome or intro email and on the top panel it will show you the timing after the customer receive or purchase a product and also under this email body we can also personalize some other contacts including the customer name product name and many more and from here we could also navigate the editing tools such as by simply highlighting all of these text let's say we're going to make this italic by clicking this italic icon it will show you that the text has now been italicized or you could also turn it into a bullet form if you want to. Or even add an images by clicking this image button. And just upload an images from your computer files. And from here it will show you that the images has now been uploaded. However, we're going to delete this file. And aside from that, we could also add here to insert the text including the name and also the link of it. So basically, aside from personalizing by adding the customer name, my name, username and many more. You could also add here a product link if you want to depending on your preferences. Moving on to sample feedback, after receiving the welcome email, the customer will receive this kind of feedback email and this is basically the template of it. And from here, you could also do the same process by simply navigating or customizing the whole context and even deleting this kind of email subject. Now by saving this as a drop to save the changes that we just did. But for instance, we're going to add additional email to add to this flow by clicking this add email button below here. It will show you on the right side panel that all you need to do is to simply fill out the email subject in here and also the email body. For example, under email subject, I'm going to enter here sample email flow 
well for the email body let's see we're going to enter here a welcome or this kind of message in here which is we are pleased to welcome you to our store and below you could also enter here additional context if you want to but for instance i'm going to enter here our product and also add a personalized by clicking this plus personalized icon on the top panel and select product name and after that just add additional context about our product and aside from that if you also want to add the product link you can do so by clicking this add product link button and on the search bar kindly search this to kind of product link that you prefer now going back in here we could also save this as a drop and test send in order to send what it looks like when a customer tried to receive this by clicking the send button it will be automatically sent to our email and if we go to our email inboxes it will show you in here that this is what the email looks like upon receiving by other customer in here but all of these are just sample flow instant store to create new flow just click this add flow button on the top right corner and upon clicking on it just enter here the flow title and also the product that you want for instance under this flow title i'm going to enter here sample flow then click the create button below here to proceed but you'd also toggle on this one to remove customer from flow after the product purchase and now to proceed by clicking this button below will automatically be directed on this sample flow and to start adding your email or step one which is to add email by clicking this add email button from here it will show you that we can simply add here the subject but it has automatically kind of elements including the email subject that has been filled out we're going to customize this into welcome email so if the customer tried to purchase our product this is basically the welcome email that they will receive and from here we can customize the timing which is three minutes after the purchase and aside from that below here under email body we could also try to customize some other dish elements or context by be clicking this add email we can add a new one and also the subject in here or alternatively we could also copy some of this email flow or templates in here for example we're going to copy the next one which is sample feedback by clicking on the sample feedback right here we can simply copy all of this content by selecting it and copying this we can now go back on our sample flow that we're creating and from here just simply paste the context of the email that we just copy earlier so as you can see we have now successfully copy all of the context in the feedback email so you can just customize using the editing tools or even save this as a drop but make sure that you also adhere an email subject and now by clicking the save job we could also publish this if you want to so basically it is important to create an email flows in sansor since it enhances communication and marketing strategies for content creators and an email flow consists of a series of pre-scheduled emails that are automatically sent based on specific triggers or intervals in which this automation streamlines the process of nurturing leads and engaging with an audience without requiring constant manual effort and aside from that from here you could also navigate this broadcast to send personalized message or promote one-time offer or these recipients in which you can alt here all of your recipients such as by adding the name email status and tag but overall that is just basically how you can use this or in creating email flow thank you